we are all spiritually connected. We are all brothers and sisters. Many people would say to me, but how can I be spiritual? You know, how can I connect to God? How can I connect to the angels, to my loved ones who have gone before me? And I would say, in a sense, we are the power of heaven. It's just to awaken that within us. Extreme cases will be a part of the sanctuary. I've been doing them nearly all my life, but nobody knew. An extreme case is someone that has a dying wish, and that can be a father or a mother or a child. So much has happened in that family's life that when God opens that door for one of them to come, the whole family comes. It's healing and it's letting everything out. Now, in a sense, God has given me more space and please God, more time to help extreme cases as well. So even the people that have said yes already for the sanctuary, they know I do extreme cases. I think for someone to step forward and say yes, even though they may not see the result of it, it's knowing that they help someone to make a new world, to give that happiness and joy. I think the start is to build it up, to allow people of all ages and all faiths and even of none, no boundaries, to see that they can come and they can start to learn to become connected spiritually to their soul. It's like an infusion that the soul can give the human person, that intertwining. We have to allow evolution to happen and the sanctuary has a huge part to play in all of that. All the incredible, wonderful things that you can't even imagine.